Easily three star the Dark Ages Warden Challenge with this tutorial. The new event attack showcases the Warden skin available in the Gold Pass as the first reward as well. If you are purchasing this, you can support a creator beforehand by entering their code. My code is Judo and it is much appreciated, my friends. Within the challenge, you will also notice the Dark Ages scenery. This is coming to the shop later in the month alongside the Queen skin. The Dark Ages King and Royal Champion skin will be available next month. Let's show you how to beat this base. This attack looks very daunting, but it is extremely well designed. Start by assuring your Grand Warden is set to ground, select your skeleton spell, place it right on top of that clan castle. Thank you for the challenge, Sir Moose. Take the Grand Warden and now place it to the top of the Dragon Trophy on the left with your healer and then clone the healer. Once you have done this, place a Valkyrie right on top of the Warden. This will run to the north. The reason I do this is I have drilled this strategy a lot. And on rare occasions, the Warden would be attracted to the Builder Hut, miss the scatter shot, so that just assures he attacks the scatter shot. Now select the red spell. This is your recall spell if you've not unlocked it yet. We will be placing this on the Warden and the healers once the scatter shot goes down. So there we go. Now you need to select the recall spell that has the Warden. This is to the right hand side there. Place him then to the Dragon Trophy on the right and clone your healers again. You can then select the recall spell ready to recall the warden once he takes down this scatter shot. So some of this attack is managing the selection of your spells, but now you can just chill a little bit whilst he takes that scatter shot. Might give you time to subscribe if you find this helpful and enjoy my Clash of Clans videos. Thank you for the support on the channel. But once this scatter shot goes down, we will recall this warden one more time. So there we go, let's recall him. Now select the Valkyrie. Place one on top of the Dragon Trophy here on the right, one on top of the Dragon Trophy to the left. We're going to allow them to take the Builder Huts down and move towards the south. Then in true Samuth's fashion, we will spam from the bottom. Starting with the Ice Golems, you want to have roughly an even split either side of the arrows, so around about five Ice Golems to the left, five to the right. Then you can place this recalled Warden the Raged Valkyries, the two Witches, and four Valkyries. Save onto one of them alongside that clone spell. Use the Warden ability to try and encompass as many of those regular Valkyries as possible. They will run towards that Town Hall and Whirlwind attack the Town Hall and the Monoliths. Once the Town Hall goes down, look at where most of the troops go. Place your Valkyrie to the other side, so in this case, the right and then you can clone that Valkyrie as it moves forward to give you reinforcement to the monoliths. Not always necessary, but guarantees they go down because on rare occasions, you might get unlucky, your warden gets locked onto by the monolith, but that cloning of the Valkyrie will assure you get the three star. Best of luck with this one, my friends. I really enjoyed this challenge. If you enjoyed this video, YouTube thinks you will like this one. Have a good day.